Hey, y'all. Um, it's April the 26th, <clears throat> 2016. Right? And you're probably aware, especially if you're trolling my channel, that this guy right here. I have no life. Not at all. Uh, I'm also autistic. Right? That's, that's autistic slash fantastic. Alright? Um, and I cover things like autism. Because it hits very close to home. Right? And I got my boots on the ground. <clears throat> and what I'm trying to tell you, what I'm trying to get across to you is that autism it does not exist in a vacuum. No, no. Right? Autism is skyrocketing. Yes, it is. Right? By every metric. Right? And th this is because uh, little children are being damaged severely. Right? Certain children uh, who are deemed autistic are being damaged well more than other children. But I gotta explain to you that in generality, the populace of children, of our children in America and globally, are being attacked. They're being attacked, all right, in, in a number of different ways. I mean, chemically speaking, they are being attacked, all right? I'll let that sink in through vaccine, right? And vaccines aren't bad. Like I said, I'll say it a million times. Vaccines are not bad. However, when you give a little baby too many vaccines, that is bad, right? Because it's going to overload their system. Plus, when you dump in mercury and aluminum and all sort of bullshit, it is bad. It's very bad. It's going to hurt them, all right? And uh, the list goes on and on. GMOs. Right? Pesticide on your food. Understand this pesticides put in your food. All the preservatives that are put in your food. All this uh, additives, artificial additives, and things like that. Your water, it's poison. I promise you. You might think, how does he know about my water? Your water is poison. I promise you. You need to filter that stuff. You need to get extra purified. It needs to be like eight steps, dude. Your water is all sort of poison. Right? They're spraying poison over your skies. They're saying, hey, that's normal. No, it's not normal. Chuck Norris will tell you it's not normal. It's just not normal. It's hurting every child. It's hurting every human being. Right? Some children and human beings, they get affected. Uh, to an extreme extent, and they become what's called autistic. But it's not only that. Uh, that's not the only factor uh, leading to the skyrocketing autism that everybody's witnessing. No, it's not. It's also social constructs. It's social retardation, all right? And I see it everywhere I go, all right? I love the people. I love the children especially and stuff, but I'm seeing it everywhere that I go, all right? Uh, social justice. You might know social justice warriors out there. They like to be politically correct, all right? This is a cancer on uh, the American people and people in general. All right? And people are becoming very disenfranchised, very disillusioned. All right? And it's no coincidence that autistic people have trouble looking people in the eyes. People in general have trouble looking me in my eyes and stuff, dude. What's so scary about me? You can't look me in my eyes. People don't have respect for themselves sometimes. A lot of times nowadays, they have a, a, a lot of difficulty relating to folks. It's a sad thing. They have a difficulty con connecting with other folks. And an extreme example of this is autistic folks. They have lots of trouble. They're not uh, worthless. Not at all. They're actually very special. We need to take very good care of them. All right. So certain, certain people with autism that are very, very badly affected. And they do not need to be swept under the rug. That is unacceptable. All right. But like I said, the social justice, this political correctness, it is a retardation on you. It's being forced on you. It's being forced on you. It's being forced on me. All right. I'm not just calling you out. I spent a good, good, good portion of my life in public school learning not a damn thing. Not anything that was worth anything. They wasted my time. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you got you know, songs on the radio. You got what's on the television. This, this is all conspiring against you to make you retarded socially. Right? And this is also contributing to um, autism. That's bad. And I'm here fighting against it, all right? And I ain't gonna stop. I can't stop. I won't stop. All right? But I wanted to bring your attention to this little girl. I found a little girl on the internet. She's in sixth grade. All right? And she truly is a soldier. And it's fight, whether she knows it or not, her name's Lieutenant Corbis. You can find her on YouTube. It's already gone viral. She needs to go extra special viral. That's so why I'm bringing her up to you, all right? Because the social retardation that's being forced on us, that's wasting our time. Because Lieutenant Corbett, she's not having it, all right? She's all over the map, all right? She's going very, very hard in the paint, all right? And I want to shout her out. I want to commend her, all right? Because honestly, I look up to this little girl. I really do. I got a feeling she could kick my ass if she wanted to. And I'm happy about that. You need to go check her out and stuff, man. She's captivating, all right? And she's a window into the hope. She's a beacon of hope. For this new generation to overcome the bullshit that we've been taught in public schools. The bullshit that's wasting our time. You know what I'm saying? There's a balance. On one end of the spectrum, we got completely uh, just, like I said, worthless. Uh, young people out there slobbering on themselves. And I don't mean to make fun of them. But straight slobbering on themselves. So worried about what this person might think, what that person might think, and what it is they can and can't say. You know what, Lieutenant Corbett, she's not having it, alright? You need to check her out. All right? Um, that's all I got right now. I'm going to holler at y'all later. All right? Y'all hold your head up. Uh, I have one troll. Shout out to that troll. You know what I'm saying?
uh, hold your head up as well. Man, Selena Gomez, not really Selena Gomez. But shout out, I love you. God bless you. You need to, um, you need to get a load of the truth real quick and stuff, man. Stop wasting your life just how you've been trained to waste your life and stuff. It's a sad, sad situation. All right, I'll holler at y'all. It's April the 26th, 2016.